OMG guys, OMG, you won't believe what just arrived. Oh, this is a package and a half. Let's just say it's one of the, one of the installments, one of the major installments of our place. OMG, it's here. Mobile High Squad, check out what just arrived. Hey guys, welcome to my daily vlogs. Please subscribe. OMG guys, it took a truck to bring it in. Oh my gosh, it's here, it's here, it's here. Mambo High Squad. By the way, if you're new to the vlogs, welcome to the channel. My name is Mikey Bustos. We are here at the Mabuhai Squad farmhouse, our future home, well, the future home of my partner and I, our pets, and um, our team. And guys, we're receiving now something really awesome. I want you guys to see it. It's right there. Can you guys guess what it is? OMG, they're trying to see if there's enough space for them to crane it in to the home. It's gonna be carried, I guess, through that crane and stuck through the window into our master bedroom. Do you guys know what it is yet? So this is the control panel for the thing that arrived. Mm -hmm. I can't believe it's got a remote control. This is gonna be interesting. Oh, OMG, this is cool. I wonder if they could like help me ship in my ant farms at the condo this way. <laughs> and up it goes. Oh, he's just controlling it from here. Wow, 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 wow. This is crazy. All right, it'll be shipped in through this window, I guess. Look at it, look at it. Wow, wow, wow. How awesome. Oh, I can't believe it's just hanging from these, like, it looks like pieces of cloth. OMG, guys, here it comes. It's gonna be fit through this window here. It's crazy. Guys, machinery is so amazing to me. Like, what did people do back in the day when we didn't have cranes? You know, like, it had to be hoisted up by like many men or other sort of primitive machinery. Who knows, like huge logs and rope. Wow, 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 wow. It's coming in, it's coming in. So um, this is a company in the US that, well, the materials are manufactured in the US and the entire unit is manufactured in China. OMG, how are they going to do it? I'm curious. They got to figure this out. Oh. Wow. Oh man. My heart's pounding. Do you guys know what it is yet? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow, so they, they readjusted the location of the band to move it that way so that's how they pulled it in wow uh, this is problem solving so they're removing the bands now and i think it's just gonna be manual carrying now from here i don't know where they're gonna put it guys this is crazy oh my gosh they're carrying it whoa whoa wow and that's that it's in so now they're gonna put it aside so guys they're not gonna open it yet but this here is our jacuzzi yay now it's not a huge massive jacuzzi i believe this is a two seater um or two or three person seater um we just wanted one that would fit nicely into our room our bedroom here um and you know could fit me rj and possibly like some kids if we have kids or i don't know our dogs i don't know um so it's a perfect size for just really two or three people or two people and like some kids it's in there yay can't wait to drink wine with you and chill all right guys so i prepared my meal for today a big chunk of salmon tons of quinoa onion and then for later i've got the same i've got a chunk of salmon arugula lettuce carrots peas and corn and black rice oh and chunks of garlic too love garlic <laughs> hi there good afternoon goats good afternoon are you still afraid of humans hi billy there's billy our goat there's no excuse for you to be afraid of people i'm nice okay you've ran away from me for months hi mom can you convince your kid that I'm okay? Hi there, you're so big now. I just want to hug you, kid. You're almost as big as mom. Guys, look at Billy. Look at, he's smiling for you. Smile, cheese, cheese. <laughs> Why are you doing that with your lips? <laughs> uh-huh, yeah. 
Thank you very much. The goats on the Mabuhay Squad farm, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> All right, we're back. Let's see. Let's see how the dogs have been. We were just gone for like a few hours. Hey guys. Hey guys. <laughs> Hi guys, did you miss us? Did you miss us? Hi guys, yes! Oh my gosh, this third dog is a little more aggressive with his greetings. Hi guys, told you we'd be back. Thank you Ate Elsie. Yay, salamat. Guys, I am so excited because Ate Elsie brought baby powder. Yes! Okay, now if you're from like Canada or US like me, not from a tropical climate, you might be thinking, what are you doing? Baby powder for what? Well, guys, this stuff is magical in the Philippines. Because if you're ever in a place like here where there's no air conditioning, like air conditioners are also dehumidifiers, right? And so with no air conditioning, things tend to get a bit like stick, like damp. I find it a little bit hard to sleep when beddings are a bit damp, but because like I feel sticky, you know what I mean? Like, Hello. I'm the kind of guy who can't sleep if I feel sticky. Oh, yeah. Baby powder helps that stickiness go away. Oh my gosh, I feel so unsticky right now. It is magical. Oh, baby powder, I love you. Oh gee, it's awesome. Oh, I'm so not sticky. I love this feeling, guys. To whoever invented talcum powder, genius. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys it's night time and i am all ready for bed rj's dying of laughter i put so much baby powder in i'm actually wearing a long sleeve so that and you'll be like isn't that counterproductive won't you sweat more no i'm wearing a long sleeve because all in here is baby powder and i feel so dry and luscious it's wonderful i'm gonna see if this will help me sleep better <laughs> Mmm, I've never been so in love with baby powder, like, ever in my life. Good morning, Mabuhay Squad. Oh, it's a gorgeous morning here at Sonia's Garden. Did you guys sleep well? Hmm? I know I did in my layer of baby powder. So yeah, RJ and I and the dogs, there's Rizal, the dogs are here, we're walking now, just gonna stroll around Sonia's garden, enjoy some morning sun. Rizal, did you sleep well? Guys, he's peeing and pooing in the right spot, but we like restrict him just to that like atrium area, the receiving area of our cottage, but he pees and poos in the right spot, which is good. The dogs love the morning stroll. <laughs> They're always hot on some trail, on some scent trail. What do you guys smell? Hmm? You smell a deer? What? Elephant? Rhino? Good morning, Tita Sonia. Wow, look at your beautiful uh, yellow golf cart. There's Ugo. Cypher, shh, cypher, shh. The yellow limo, yes. Oh, wait, Tita Sonia harvested. What is it? Oh, beets. Mm. Good for your liver. Oh, is I'll it? Have it boiled and I'll share it with you. Oh, thank you. I love red beets. They're my favorite. Wow, so healthy, guys. That one and only Sonia Garcia of Sonia's Garden. Bye, Hugo. Cypher, you are so noisy. You embarrass me in front of everybody. Oh, bye. I love her yellow golf cart. RJ, we need a yellow golf cart. So they sell a bunch of products. They always have like various things. Bagoong, anchovies, guava jam, stuff that they make themselves here. Of course, all organic. They've always sold this stuff, but they sell it now, especially because of the pandemic, right? Like we're currently under lockdown. So if people come here and order some of their products, it helps uh, support the community who work here, you know, support the staff of Sonia's Garden. So feel free to come by and they also sell plants, of course, as you know, during the pandemic, keeping of house plants became super popular, especially here in the Philippines. Uh, so they're selling plants as well. Feel free to come by at Sonia's Garden and pick up a plant for your home. And again, it supports the locals here in Alfonso uh, who work here at Sonia's Garden. Actually, Sonia's Garden is a bountiful metaphoric garden of abundance for the community who lived here. You know, when Tita Sonia first came here years ago now, the community was mostly doing farming and uh, 
um, they were finding it hard to make ends meet, I suppose. Tita Sonia came at just the right time to build this place and give the entire community here in Alfonso employment. And Sonia's garden gives employment to the locals here, which is great. It supports them and their families and goodness all around. What a gorgeous day it is today. See, sunny, placid, nature. Love this view. All right, guys, let's see our positive affirmation for Tuesday, August the 17th. When I make a mistake, I realize that it is only part of the learning process. Ooh, love that, guys. Hope you enjoy today's positive affirmation. When I make a mistake, I realize that it is only part of the learning process. OMG, my boy high squad. I'm looking out my window and you guys won't believe these awesome birds I'm looking at right now. I'll try not to scare it. Oh, there's two of them. Let me show you. 